Welcome in as we're here to learn more about the honors program and what it's like here at Southeastern Louisiana University. Today, we have two of the honors students here on campus, Tyler and Mateo. So Tyler, uh, tell us what it's like and some of the advantage of being in the honors program here at Southeastern. So the honors program really is just a way to elevate your education on top of your standard degree. Um, they offer a variety of the courses that are unique to each program. And on top of that, you know, you get to work on cool projects in the honors program. And Mateo, talk about some of the classes that we have within our honors program. Yeah, I mean, honors at Southeastern is cool because it allows you to connect with people across all different subjects and categories. And so one of the things that's available are classes in all of those different subjects and categories. So my first semester at Southeastern, I went ahead and took a history 101 honors as a Western civilization. And it worked just like a normal Western civilization class, but we got to go into more depth and we got to get into a little more nuance. And then when our exams, we also... Um, had more opportunities to really express what we learned in, a, in an individualized manner rather than like multiple choice we got more chances to write out what we actually thought and understood and then alongside those more traditional classes that just have an honors variation we also have some honor specific classes that are just purely for honor students that are kind of a normal topic so my second semester i took one on corporate crowdsourcing and this current semester i'm taking one where we're literally recreating the Constitutional Convention of 1787. So we're all getting different founding father roles and getting to role play those different characters. Um, so it's a lot of fun and it really allows us to explore the nuance of ideas and activities. So in addition, what are some of the projects that a students work on in the honors program? Yeah, the really cool part about um, you know, the honors project uh, or an honors program in particular, especially these classes, is the projects that are incorporated into each of these classes. Um, on top of, you know, your standard lecture, you know, and examinations, um, like for one of my biology classes, I was able to do a photo safari of biological organisms and I counted it as one of my exams. Yeah, and on top of that, you know, we have things like the Southern Regional Honors Conference, which we get to participate in, where, you know, last year I got to go ahead and put together a presentation about the benefits of an early college program at a university and got to talk about, okay, why should colleges have early college programs? So there's a lot of ability to pursue and really explore something that you're interested in individually. Now, students are watching this. They love the idea of the projects. They love the idea of the classes being offered and the smaller class size and everything. So Tyler, what's the, what's the way students can join the honors program? Uh, so the honors program, you pretty much apply online. Um, here are the requirements listed. You see you need a, a ACT a composite of 24 or above and a high school GPA of 3.0 or above. Um, on top of that, you know, if you're applying a little bit later, maybe a second semester of your freshman year, all you need is um, 12 hours of college credit at 3.0 or above GPA. And you can apply at the link. And the only, re only like requirements you really need to stay in the honors program is keep above a 3.0 GPA. All right, good stuff, guys. If you want to learn more information, visit southeastern.edu forward slash honors.